Okay guys, so what we're doing here, this is es un baño para la suerte con Yemaya. Um, also known as la Virgen de la Regla. So it's for luck. Okay, it's really simple. You're just gonna need a watermelon. You can buy either a blue candle dedicated to her and a white candle or you can do, I'm, I'm just using one in this case. I didn't have a white candle with me, but she's fine. She's happy with just one. That's fine. Whatever you have, if you prefer to buy the blue and the white, okay. If not, just the blue is fine or a white one by itself is fine as well. Okay, what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut the watermelon in half leaving one side bigger than the other okay and you're going to scoop out um what i did in my case i actually i like to give her an offering with the same watermelon so i sliced it i sliced the smaller half into seven little pieces and i'll show you guys how i did that after but i put seven pieces aside and then i used the remaining the remaining part uh to go in the other half so the bigger portion you're going to scrape out the insides of the, of the melon try to preserve the, the liquid the juice um and then with the extra pieces you have from the smaller half, you're going to kind of smush that up into that, use that bigger half as if it's like a basket, okay? That's what I'm doing right here. I'm, I like to use my hands, I cover my hands in cascarilla, and then I use my hands to uh, to scrape it out as much as I can, because I don't want my skin to you know separate from the nail. So I, I do what I can, and if I have to use something, then I will, but just to make sure I scrape it all. You know what I'm saying? So you're gonna do that, and then you're gonna put seven spoonfuls of Melao, so eso es um, molasses, molasses. You're gonna do seven spoonfuls of molasses inside of the, once you've already got all the watermelon scraped off, inside that bigger half of the melon, you're gonna pour seven spoonfuls of molasses over it, okay? That goes on a white plate. That white plate is also gonna go on whatever altar you have for Yemaya. You're gonna put that there for her with her offering, with the candle, and that's where you say a prayer for whatever it is you need. You know, ask her to bring in the blessings. Whatever it is that you're looking for. If you have a trip over water, you know what I mean? This, she's, she's, she's our mom. She's everybody's mom. She's where we start. So ask her for her health. Light the candle for seven hours. At the end of seven hours, you're going to shower with this. The bigger half. The offering is hers bigger half of the melon that has all the stuff in it you're gonna shower with that from the bottom up even your hair everything and then rinse off and dress light if you can wear something white if you can have like white bed sheets para que tu cuerpo toque el blanco at least you know or have like a white undershirt just so that your skin is touching the white um you may want to do it later on in the evening that way you can kind of lay low for the rest of the day and you can take it easy avoid arguments and stuff like that um, and that's it. And then clean up the mess and you're good. You can put it in a paper bag and toss it out. Okay. Thank you so much. And I hope that this works out for you. Alrighty guys. Bye-bye. Just kidding. I'm back. What I'm doing right here is I'm just preparing the candle. You don't have to do anything. You can just light the candle when you buy the candle. That's fine. But I choose to uh, carve some things in it and I put uh, silver flakes um, she prefers silver, so I, I put silver for her, and if it was Ochung, I would have put gold flakes. But um, in this case, I used the silver, and I put seashells and a little bit of sand from the beach inside of the candle with some coconut oil. Um, I think that's all I used. Um, and that's it. So if it's for a particular trip or whatever it is, you can always write that and put it on the bottom of the candle and put that along in the center of the well, you'll see right now at the end how the offering looks, but you can put it underneath the candle para que agarre the heat um, so she can pick up on that. And so far it looks, I'm looking at the finished and it, it looks great. It, it, she accepted it well, I think I would say. Um, okay, my dear, so I hope that you get everything that I get from this um, when you do this. Alrighty? Okay, I love you guys. Bye-bye. I'm back, just kidding again. This is what it looks like. This is that's the offering with the candle, and that's the the bath is right in front, okay? Leave that.